Nike. Probably I'm not going to show you. And I'm actually kind of really excited about them. I don't know. Hello guys and welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Roxy and I talk about anime. Funko Pops and manga and anything related to it. So if you're a fan, make sure to stay tuned for the videos that appear every Saturday. Today's video is going to be about some packages that I want to unbox with you. And those packages are these. So from Ozon Package, I'm having, I guess there were three pops or at least two pops. I kind of forgot the number of them because this is what I ordered like weeks ago and I just, I don't know how, how I am so, I don't know how I am so patient and not did unbox this for you guys. Just, I didn't unbox it just only for this video. So just take a round of applause, okay? Because usually I'm not a patient. And this box is actually kind of cool because it has a mystery Funko Pop box. Also, disclaimer, all my Funko Pops are related to anime and usually probably I'm not going to show you the Marvel ones that I will be ordering, but let me know in the comments below if you would want to. And also make sure to stay tuned until the end of the video because we will be having some Funko Pop news related to My Hero Academia, Boruto, and probably Attack on Titan and Pokemon. And I'm actually kind of really excited about them. I don't know. I don't know why I'm so excited because usually I'm excited for pops, but these ones, just wait to see them, okay? I have my trusty cloud here, which probably would remember if you're following me on TikTok, which by the way, you can subscribe to my channel and you can like the video because it would help me so much. And thank you for 200 subscribers. That's amazing. Okay, so first I'm going to cut this off of camera because it's probably going to be so loud. Okay, so this is the insides of the box. And I'm like showing you what I see. And I'm trying to not peek and just grab one. And I just loved this version of the Tania of the Ida. Glow in the Dark is special edition. Also, all my Funko Pops are there. So basically, I just love this Ida and it's glowing in the dark and it's actually glowing in the dark fully. Just make sure you're tuning in for the shorts because I think I'm going to do an out of the box video with them separate, but on shorts. The next one, the next one I'm not looking, it's Bakugo. And I truly really love this version because of, I don't know, his hair, like him getting all this propulsion from the back and just, I don't know, it reminds me so much of the first training and like actually the first time that I've seen them in action. And it just kind of, I don't know, it's just so cool. And also it's like special edition. I'm like obsessed with stickers and whatever. I don't really have commons on like, sure I have croc from one piece, which is a common and it's like the only variant, but unless they're having a special edition, you won't see me collecting commons. I don't know why, but yeah. And the last one. The last one is Sora though, she is super cool. Actually, I wanted to buy the special edition for her because it was like kind of a glowing Chidori or something, but I don't think it would be like, I don't know, good. So I wanted that version with glow in the dark, but I couldn't like wait for more. So with all the common discussion and whatsoever, I know that I said that I don't collect super common ones or like the common ones that don't have any sticker here, but like, the glow in the dark one was only a website exclusive and like Funko Pop exclusive. And whenever I wanted to buy it, it was out of stock, out of stock. And I was like, okay, maybe this is not for me. So I got her like this, but I still love her and she's amazing. And she's going with the Kowakin Boruto that I have, which I'm excited. Off with the box and it's going to be on the floor. Sure, I'm going to clean because I'm usually a neat person. I'm just, I'm a clean freak, okay? And next, the biggest box, which again, I'm going to cut it, like probably is going to be sped up or something. Okay, so these ones are really packaged well because I cannot see anything and I forgot what I ordered. So it's going to be a surprise for both of us. Oh, 
okay, they're having green bubble wrap? Just hang on. I'm just going to carefully cut the bubble wrap. Okay, so basically they are looking like this and I'm just going to grab one of each. And this is like the Spider-Man that I wanted. Oh my god. I just... Hold on. Hold on, hold on. This is the mystery pop? I cannot talk. I actually wanted to order this yesterday. Yesterday I wanted to order this but I was like... I was like talking to my boyfriend because we are basically having the same manga and Funko Pop collection that I'm storing in my huge bookshelf because he doesn't have space so everything goes for me and also I can make this cool background for you guys which I just I don't know I just love organizing and having my stuff so yeah but like I wanted this so bad and because it's like the Easter version and you're telling me that something stopped and like I was like I was telling my boyfriend you know how about probably we wouldn't like buy this because I don't know we want like I just don't want to spend all the money on this one and also shipping and like not buy a second one so like thank you thank you so basically the sale was like buy three pops and get one mystery and this one and also I talked about me not knowing if I would unbox like Marvel I'm like a super huge Marvel and probably I would do also Marvel backlips unboxing so let me know in the comments below if you're down for it I don't know but I'm 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 astonished thank you I'm just they really got me oh my god Okay, and now I'm getting to the pops that I actually ordered, but yeah, I actually ordered a Nishinoya. I'm just going to put it in the picture here, but he wasn't in stock. And I just hate it because I got it replaced, but I got it replaced with someone super good. And no, it's not this one. Hold on. I'm also having like Maki. Oh, I just, I love Fire Force and I wanted this one so too. But hold on. So I wanted like... I ordered Nishinoya and I was like, okay, I want Conan because they didn't have like the Noya that I wanted, but like they sent me Maki instead, I guess. That's wild. I just hope that the last one is like actually the one that I ordered. Oh my god, and yes it is. I just I just love the Hidan. And also if you didn't know, there is actually a new Hidan, a brand new Hidan. You know that this Chase variant is basically the one with like his juice and skeletal form? Well, the other one, it's actually the common one and it's not the Chase. And it's him with the coat. I'm going to insert the picture somewhere. But like it's just he's amazing he's like truly amazing dropping the box so yeah i actually wanted conan but i'm not mad because i've been eyeing this pop for a while also and actually they knew that i wanted this like this one was in my wish list for like last year because I I haven't like got a chance to watch Fire Force only recently, also watching Haikyuu currently, but yeah. And I was like, okay, I just really love Maki. Probably I'm going to buy her, but it was like super expensive. But like, I'm just, I'm going to take her, okay? I'm just going to buy another Conan. I mean, it, it was the same price. And yeah, for as far as I know, it doesn't have another variant. So I'm taking it as a common. And now moving on to the part where I'm telling you the Funko Pop news and anything related to that. So let's dig in. So basically there is another Levi Pop and we know that we have Captain Levi. I feel like they kept the same mold for the Captain Levi and this Levi, but they just added the flustered look which I don't really know how I feel about it because some people do have the Captain Levi and are they going to buy this one? I doubt it. I just, I don't know. How do you feel about it? And unfortunately, this is the only AOT Funko Pop news that I had for you. So moving on to Pokemon. For Pokemon, we are having Greninja, Chinchar and Snubbull. And I just love that Snubbull. It's just like such a cute dog. And also it's also pink. I just love it. I usually am not really about all the cutesy stuff and the pink stuff. But I feel like this is a pretty cool dope Funko Pop. 
And also Chimchar. Chimchar is my goddamn very first starter that I fell in love with and especially fire starter because when I saw the Pokemon chemistry with Ash when I was watching like I don't know I think I was like eight or nine years old and I was watching on a TV channel that was basically also just I don't know giving us cartoons but also anime and when I saw Chimchar I just fell in love with him and Monferno is like by far my beloved evolution of his. And Grey Ninja, we just got him love a Grey Ninja. Look how good he is. Look just how good he is. And the blue and the shades and everything. The, and also the shapes on him. Oh my god, yes please. I'm just probably going to buy the Chimchar and the Grey Ninja. I don't know. I don't know. How do you feel about him though? Now, speaking about My Hero Academia, which I'm currently watching, let me know in the comments below if I should do some shorts about them or anime commentary because I truly love like giving the insights about how I felt for a certain, I don't know, peak fiction moment or like a really super serious fight that I thought that, I don't know, there was a plot twist or there was a cliffhanger or something, but just let me know. And for my Hero Academia, we're having this Tomura Shigaraki, which I don't know from what season he is, but he looks really amazing and I'm sure that I'm going to love it for my collection because I wanted a Shigaraki, but I wasn't like really sure if I would do the one that he has the mask and the everything like the hand mask on his face or like the metallic version of it, but... I don't know, just I don't know. And now moving on to the Boruto Funko Pop news and the newest wave that we know about it, which is amazing. Also, I forgot to mention about Mihawk and I don't know how I forgot to mention about him because he looks so cute in a Funko Pop and I just love him and especially I loved him in the live action and you know, you know guys what I'm talking about. He just, he was a magnificent actor. But like really, he looks so funny and he looks like a cat and I feel like, you know that if you're watching anime, you know or may not know, but for sure you know, you know that the anime characters, they are depicted as cats and they are drawn from cats because they just resemble this cuteness and whatever. So, so his mustache and tiny beard really resemble a cat face. It's just so hilarious. Now, truly moving on to the Boruto ones because I just forgot about Mihawk, I'm sorry. We are having Himawari which she's like super cool, she's super cutesy with the tiny skirt and with her pink and whatever, with her big blue eyes, I just love her. And also the chase variant from the scene when where she made Kurama and Naruto tremble, as I talked just literally in my previous video about it. And I just would love to have the pop in the chase variant, but I don't think that I would find it. Also, we are having an Amazon exclusive Ishki, which is glow in the dark, which is super cool. It's goddamn super cool with the horn and the transformation and everything. And also speaking of Ishki, we are having a Jigen one. Which, with the his tiny bald head, he looks like a doll. He just looks like a doll. He doesn't look frightened or something. Like, he always looks. And also, like, the car symbol on his face. They really nailed it with the detail. Actually, I love the, the pose and you see the nails and you see the kind of the robe that he's wearing. I just love it. Speaking of another designs that I truly loved from the Boruto line and the newest wave is the Kashin Koji one. The Kashin Koji one, we've all wanted to hear about it. We've all wanted to know about how he looked, about how he's going to have, if he's going to have any variants, if he's going to have any chases. I don't know, let me know if you're going to pick it up because I'm such a Kashin Koji fan and he also my boyfriend is, but we truly want this in our collection for sure. And last but not least, there is Mirai and Mirai Sarutobi, but I'm not actually pretty sure if I'm going to if I'm going to pick it up because I feel like we don't actually know a lot about Mirai. Like she didn't have enough screen time. And also I know that we do have the short manga about her. But that that's just not enough. That's just not enough. I just want more from her. And I just love that she's like Kurina and Asuma's daughter. But I feel like I'm not really identifying with her and I'm not really curious about her story or anything. So hence, I don't think I'm going to own the Funko Pop. I think I'm going to do an actual Funko Pop tour when I will be having more of them because the collection is super new because I just started collecting, I guess, 
last August or last August 2023. So for sure, I'm going to come back with a video with more unboxings and probably a Funko Pop, well, probably, definitely a Funko Pop tour. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe and see you for next Saturday and also on shorts and community posts or Instagram. So make sure you follow also my socials and see you then. Goodbye.